All right, time now for another round of our always rousing roundtable topics with our inimitable panel of talkers, Corey Dillon from Mix 100.7, Anjali Queen B. McGuire from 95.7 The Beat, you. and Drew Garabo from 102.5 The Bone. Yeah. Hi, Hi, guys. guys. Hi. Hi. How it's are you? What's inimitable mean? Inimitable? Yeah. It means cannot be imitated. There you go. Inimitable. Yes, that's they inimitable. Work, nor would they okay. want to try. No, and, and they should not. No. <laughs> hey, you know, everybody's still talking about the gorilla that was yeah. shot at the Cincinnati Zoo in order to protect it. a four-year-old boy who fell into the exhibit. The director of the zoo says it's easy to second guess after the boy was recovered safely, but the director of the zoo said the rare gorilla was agitated and disoriented by the commotion after the boy fell. Well, yes, the gorilla appeared to be protective of the boy at times, but also dragged it through the shallow moat. We've all seen the video. Yes. He added the gorilla should uh, or could crush a coconut in one hand, mm. and there was no doubt the boy's life could have been in danger. Did the zoo do the right thing, and what do you think is going to come out of all of this? Of course, they, of course they did the right thing. Yes. I mean, I think, even though, you know, humans aren't about to go extinct probably like gorillas are, mm. but, but you know, they did do the right thing. I know that every zoo has a different protocol. It's just interesting to me to know that, what, in Palm Beach County, wasn't it recently? Uh, an actual zookeeper entered and she was killed by lions. They, mm -hmm. they didn't take the opportunity there to protect human life over animal life. But. I'm so sad. I grew up in Cincinnati and I have very fond memories of the Cincinnati Zoo. But one thing I do remember is it's very uh, pr protected for mm -hmm. the animals and for the uh, visitors. So I really am, I, I don't understand the parents how they let their child get under two fences and roll under a bush in order to get into that enclosure. And, yeah. and again, it's all 15 feet. Mm -hmm. There's right. possible charges that, that, I mean, all kinds of uh, talk about charges right when, now. When it comes and, to a baby, you have to protect that child. So I, I think it's really sad and unfortunate that they had to kill Harambe, but my concern really is with the parents. Like how, I understand, I'm a parent too. You can't keep your eyes on your kids 100% of the time. But this child apparently told his mother, I'm going in there. I want to go in there. And she said, no, you're not. But then got distracted with her other kids. And he proceeded to reach his goal. The zoo did okay. the right thing by putting the gorilla down. But here's where the zoo did not do the right thing. There should be a 0% chance that any kid yes. can reach a gorilla. Thank and that's yes. where they screwed up. Thank if you, you have an animal like a gorilla, a lion, anything, there should be 0% chance that anyone can breach that. And they messed up by allowing the possibility. Sure, the parents could have kept an eye. But the zoo is in the business of protecting their animals and their patrons. Bingo. And they this messed up big time. This is not the first Bingo. time this, this zoo has had an issue. Right. Yeah. Uh, there polar, should be. Polar bears have gotten out of their enclosure. Yes. They've gotten into a walkway that they weren't supposed to be in. A monkey has gotten out and bitten somebody, and a big cat got out as well. Yeah, so th there every, are issues there. Every yeah. one of these exhibits should be hermetically sealed yep. from mm -hmm. anyone, yeah. child or adult, from getting in. Yeah, you but just, none of these you parks, know. Is, a, is you know, as, as some of the uh, animal experts have put it, put out there, that none of these parks, they're not meant to babysit your kids. You know what I mean? True. You know, there, but there, there is some there, risk. You're trying to get close to these animals. Yeah. yeah, there's a way yes. to get close without yeah. having a, a, the ability for a child to get yeah. through a fence. Uh, 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 Correct. Yeah, amen. I mean, that's that's the bottom line. Yes, the parents should have some account accountability, sure. but I think even more than that, the zoo should make sure they protect their visitors. Yep, and, and R.I.P. Harambe. Yeah. And yeah. their yeah. animals, Everyone exactly. will be suing everyone. Yeah, yeah, unfortunately. All right, have you seen the new trailer for Finding Dory, and do you think it depicts the first ever lesbian couple in a Disney Pixar film? Vigilant fans of the animated sequel to 2003's Finding Nemo are speculating that it does. In the latest trailer, at the one minute and seven second mark, in case you want to check it. <laughs> Hank the <laughs> octopus early. ends up in a baby carriage next to two women who pick up a tot's dropped sippy cup. Disney has been under pressure, for what it's worth, for years to represent the LGBT community with characters in their films. What do we think? I say it's about time. Cool. Yeah. I agree. Great. I, just, I just don't know how from the, the two seconds or whatever, somebody <laughs> assumed this is a lesbian couple. What I mean, if they're just good friends? They're not wearing Precisely. rings. Precisely. Really? Right. Precisely. I'm, like, I'm like, what, what does that say Have about Have you frozen the frame to yes. see if they're wearing I mean, rings? What, yes. Really, 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 really Corey, Can have fish you? fish wear rings? Just, what, does this, what does this say about uh, about the stereotypes that we hold? I'm like, why does everyone assume that these this is a lesbian couple? <gasps> Maybe those characters hilarious. don't believe in the materialistic 
artistic <laughs> part <laughs> of having a ring. Maybe. Right. 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 Non-materialistic. Right. I, yeah. I thought that was the weirdest conclusion. So I wonder if something has leaked out that it is, in fact, a couple, or if this is just some random scene in the movie. Yeah. Yeah. Good, good question. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. I've been frozen a video since Madonna did Papa Don't Preach back in the 80s, and her boob popped out for a second. So I'm going to go and check out this thing, and I'll get back to you. Let us know. I think if it's, rings. if it's reflected of society, I think, like you said, it's about time. It is. Yeah. Exactly. It's not a big deal. No, no it's not a big deal. Should not, wait, no, it shouldn't be. It should not be a big deal, but we know it will be right. because we're dealing with Disney right. and we're dealing with parents who may not think this is the best thing for but their children. But children are not automatically going to assume that. Right. They have no, to be told that. Dory or they have is to... voiced by Ellen DeGeneres. Hello. Right. What does that have to do with lesbianism? <laughs> well, <laughs> she's probably the most she's out hot. there lesbian. What? <laughs> she is. <laughs> she is. So disillusioned. I bet right you now. didn't know when well. Rosie O'Donnell was a lesbian. She, she did. Her too? <laughs> Guys, cut it out. <laughs> 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 Come on. Okay, let's around. move on to a whole different topic now. Oh boy, no wonder we get letters. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm here That's for. That's okay. <laughs> Candace uh, Kashani graduated from the law school debt-free this spring. Good for her. Yep. But it's thanks to a modern twist on an age-old arrangement. She used a sugar daddy dating site to find an older man to fund her schooling. Kashani says her sugar daddy is one of her best friends and that they care deeply for each other. SeekingArrangement.com offers to connect same-sex couples looking for such arrangements or sugar mommies for men, oh, yeah. but the male-female sugar daddy dynamic makes up the bulk of its business. 1.9 million students are using this service, <laughs> just so you know. Critics call it uh, just another form of prostitution. Mm. Do you agree with this? Oh, yeah. Uh, yes. Yeah. There have yes. been relationships like this through the beginning of time. Like you said, it's age old, where a wealthy older man is, is looking to, for a arm candy mm -hmm. or a trophy on mm -hmm. his arm. And the young lady is looking for stability, financial stability. And so that arrangement is not new. No. Now, to go online and seek the arrangement, Maybe that's new because the internet is newer, but that, that situation has been in existence for a very long time. Mm -hmm. And this young lady, obviously, they they examine the parameters of, of whether or not intimacy was going to be involved. Right. At least I assume they have. Yes. And it's not like she it's was buying Gucci's guaranteed. and Louis, and she was paying well, for her college tuition. If it wasn't so, guaranteed, it's implied, I have but a feeling guaranteed. the checks would stop pairing. <laughs> right. I'm just saying. Some so, people just want companianship and friendship. Well, well if yeah. you're willing to pay for that, well, yeah, I like that. God so, <laughs> so you're. So you're, you you think this is fine? Sure, uh, this is okay. No, I, no. Really? I I mean well, I don't I don't think it's okay. Didn't she get but. her law degree? I mean you know what, what do they say? What's the difference between a lawyer and a prostitute? I'll let you look up the punchline on that one. But, <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna I, hear from the lawyers and the prostitutes <laughs> now. They're, they're both well, gonna be offended. But. You know, she, maybe she'll be a good attorney if this is the way that she's gone about her I just, business. I just right. don't think personally anybody could wake up. Uh, uh, or go to sleep knowing that they're being funded because they're because they're well she doesn't have a bill I'm sure she's sleeping just great well mm. but you know what I mean it's Maybe. like I, I, okay, everyone's, that's everyone's it more feels, it feels icky you gotta wrap this up here thanks everybody thank you yes keep those cards and letters coming folks <laughs> we'll be right back yeah, yeah. Yep.